Hello everyone, it is me, Hacker Billy again, and I'm doing another update on my Ultimate Buzz Lightyear I have been working on. I do apologize for any noise you hear in the background. My roommate is listening to his TV currently. Um, but I bought an Australian released Buzz Lightyear. Uh, this is kind of just what's left of him. He had like a weird glow of chest. But the nice part about him is he actually had a utility belt. So I ordered him. I've waited like, you know, a couple weeks for him to get in through shipping. And once he came in, I finally was able to get the utility belt and install it on this Buzz Lightyear. So now this Buzz, you can actually... Approaching destination. Re-engaging gravity. He has a working utility belt. I am Buzz Lightyear. I come in peace. Anti-gravity belt activate. Now, unfortunately, it does only say three things, but in this one, I can turn off whenever I want. Unfortunately, it does only have those three sound effects for the belt. The other nice thing about that Buzz Lightyear is it does have the movie-accurate laser noise, which I have actually added in, and it still does it to where when I first press the button, you hear the noise, and then you can still hold it and use the laser as long as you'd like. You know, the other nice part about this is this buzz, you can see it has all the details that the si signature collection one has. So, this finally has the utility belt, it has the flexible waist, it has the pop-open wings with the modded lights, it has the karate chop action, which we can do through the button and it has now a working laser with the movie sound effect not to mention that the helmet also does the whoosh thing and I have fixed the waist it no longer just comes apart you can twist and turn there's a tiny bit of a gap up in there but that's about it but you can see I am Buzz Lightyear I come in peace anti-gravity belt activate that it has now a working utility belt combined with the signature collection legs. The last thing I might do to this Buzz Lightyear is that you Australian Buzz Lightyear came with these arms, which have the little circle pieces that Buzz has in the movie. I think I can actually take these off and I could swap these out. I tried to drill little holes to make the circles. It didn't work that well. But I think I can take these and swap them onto this. And once I do that, then this Buzz Lightyear will be basically as movie accurate as I can get him. Um, and he should have everything that the movie Buzz can do except for the transparent wings and a helmet that goes all the way down. Glow in the Dark after that is next, along with touching up all the screw holes and stickers. But yeah, um, thank you all for watching. If you want to keep following updates on this Buzz Lightyear, Please make sure to subscribe and like this video. And if, eventually I'll be doing tutorials as well, since I have finally almost done with this Buzz Lightyear. Thank you all for watching.